Research is an ongoing process. Any moment that you're not working at the bench is a moment that progress is not happening. It's something that you, when you get up in the morning, you think about. When you go to bed at night, you think about. When you become engrossed in a research field, it stays with you. Some ideas you wake up with because your brain has been churning overnight about a problem. And that makes it exciting. I think what drives me most is discovery and impact. I truly believe that research can transform healthcare. You see a lot of people suffering from different diseases and you realize that if you want to do something meaningful with your life, this is the area to work in. I'm not doing research for research. I'm doing research to help patients. I think what is very special about uh, this place is everyone is a national leader in what they do. It's amazing how much fantastic research goes on here at the clinic. Things move so quickly. The reason I get up early to get in here is because of the opportunity that this place affords to be able to eventually impact the patient. Learn the Research Institute is a great place to be a researcher and I think it's a great place to develop the treatments for tomorrow. We come here every day and we know that we're making a difference in, in the patient's lives, but we know that we're not doing the research by ourselves. I do computational biology research. We do the bench work, which is the basis of all the findings it will come. Applied research. Mathematical oncologist. I'm actually more of the operational side, but I still feel like I'm at the forefront. I know that there's different titles, but I feel that we have our own contribution towards the outcome. I feel that every little thing we do really counts. I wouldn't be here without the team. It's the team that you hear working in the background. And then there's just the larger support team, that teams, I would say, that we have here. If everyone was the same, I don't think science would work. I don't think the world would work. It's really this combination of people coming together with different approaches, different ideas, different ways of dealing with information, different backgrounds. I'm from Japan. Many people from other countries, India, China, other. So our culture in the LRI is to accept their background, their way of thinking. We all have the same goal in mind. We want to help the patient. And so having that different background allows us to see things from a different perspective. And that actually helps us be better scientists. I'm in a number two institution in the country. Best team, best technology. And still, we don't always win the day. And those are the days that really fire me back up to come back to the lab. Clinicians of course knows what the issues and what to improve, right? We researchers know what to handle those issues, so working together is very important. That collaboration is absolutely critical to developing research that is meaningful to both caregivers and to patients. Impact is not reflected by how many scientific papers you can publish, but by whether or not we can really move our discoveries into translation. That's what we strive to do at the Learner Research Institute. With unlimited access to patients, to patient material, clinical trials, what we can truly do here is accelerate the transformation from bench to bedside for developing novel therapies. And so we can seamlessly transition findings from the lab to the clinic to the patient, and then from the patient all the way back to the lab. I love the fact that we make research happen, and I know that the work we do will help improve someone else's quality of life. You pass patients every day, you talk about patients every day, and I think it gives you a sense of accomplishment and a sense of drive when you're doing research and you're focused on something as small as a protein or a molecule. Because when you think about innovation, innovation is not just about creating some new invention, it's also seeing how that innovation will impact our world. 
The opportunity to practice medicine and do research at a top flight institute like Lerner is not something you can turn down. I'm really struck by the number of times that I hear people say now, oh, you know, Cleveland Clinic is such a great place, you know, and I really want to come there. I really want to be able to take advantage of all of the things that you have there. It was an easy choice for me to come here and learn from the best. Usually the fellow go back to their own country after two years. I extend it for another year, another year, <laughs> another year, and now 28 years. Why did I come to the Learner Research Institute? Well, I came because I was attracted to the possibility to be part of uh, a new team and to be able to build a translational research program that is meant to provide treatment for the future. Seeing myself in the mirror of my patient. I'm reminded every day that this is a human problem. What I'm most proud of is where we're sitting, is the lab, is the people that I get to interact with. And I think the opportunity to do things bigger is when you do them as a team, when you do them together. <laughs>